I think we're going to talk about Collision. Collision is coming. Yeah, Collision yeah. is on Saturday at 5 p.m. Uh, Pacific, 8 p.m. Eastern. Will you be watching Collision live? Yeah, I'm going to be watching it live uh, for sure, especially the first one. Uh, my, my wife and kids are at a birthday party and I'm left all alone. So what better way than uh, to watch wrestling? It's in a, in a dark, depressed room drinking by yourself <laughs> and watching it. So I'm looking forward to sounds it. sounds kind of fun. I'm going to probably go in the tub. I'm going to take a soak in my tub, and I'm going to watch Collision in the tub. I'll send you a photo. <laughs> hey, we're behind the paywall. Yeah, just we're like, behind uh, the paywall. We we can we, we can go a little bit. We can go a little dark. We can go a little blue, as long as we don't uh, have too many people narking us out to the big boss. I think we're, I think we'll be okay. Uh, so so Collision, they announced the main event. Uh, Tony Khan was on uh, on television last week. And I, I like making the joke about how he never blinks, but you know, I'm sure people make jokes about us. We do this video show, so maybe that's like kind of like the, uh, you know, don't throw stones in, in glass houses kind of thing. But I think he's getting a little better. He's getting a little better doing doing the yeah. live TV. Uh, and he mentioned the main event is to be CM Punk and FTR against uh, the Bullet Club Gold, featuring Jay White and Juice Robinson. As well as Samoa Joe, we're rekindling some mid two thousands ROH, probably the same time frame when when Dave had this computer here. Uh, so, <laughs> what do you think about this main event? Are you excited for this I think, feature main event? Yeah, smart, smart main event. You know, it protects everybody, uh, and you're also building the future programs that you're going to have. You're building Samoa Joe and and CM Punk. Uh, a potential CM Punk and Jay White singles match, which wild to think that 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 could happen. Uh, also, Juice and Punk, you know, you've you've you've, and then the tag match you've created also. So there's a lot of num there's numerous parts here moving. Also, you know that Bullet Club connection with Kenta and Forbidden Door coming could that lead into something? Mm -hmm. You know, these are all I I think originally. I think it was anticipated that it was going to be a singles match between Joe and Punk. That was the image that that I had seen, that I had you yeah, had you, seen. Yeah, you had that weeks and weeks and weeks ago. Weeks and weeks ago. See, Tony, I could I could I could shush a little bit. I don't I sit on things. <laughs> I do the same with WWE. I don't like to ruin, you know, I I when I, when I when I report stuff like sometimes I got to decide like is this something that I want to ruin? Uh not intentionally ever. But like you kind of you kind of have to be careful. Like I, I don't want to ruin main events especially for the first show, if it's a big return, you know, like I think this is all fun for everybody when we get to see it on TV. Um, but I, I, you know, you, you created a possible pay-per-view match. I mean, could that be a forbidden door match? Yeah. I think, it, I mean, would, yeah. Could you do that as a forbidden door match? Would you want to, or is that a, is that a big enough match for Wembley? You know, it leads to Wembley. This would be, I guess their sixth match. I thought it was at fourth. I was corrected on Twitter. Oh, they actually did have uh, another one. They had or did more, they have yeah. one before the the historical series? I don't. I don't. I think they might have had. I, I think probably in IWA Mid South they probably wrestled, mm. right? Um, I I I think you've created some matches even for Chicago. Like, what if Chicago is Jay White and CM Punk? That's a big match. Do you feel like All Out is a little bit of, you know, we talked about this with Double or Nothing, and I felt that Double or Nothing was kind of overlooked because of this summer of shows that I'm, I'm about to mention here in, in a little bit. But do you think All Out is kind of the back end of that? Because if, if, if you have start with Double or Nothing and you end with All Out, it seems like the, the most important shows here are Forbidden Door and All In. Now we don't know. We don't know. Maybe coming out of All In, there will be some nice stuff heading into All Out. Because are we still thinking that that is a, like a pay per view the very next week? Yeah, that pay per view is happening. Um, you know, and, and I I brought this up to somebody at AEW, and they 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 gave me a a pretty good analogy. They said, "Well, remember that first Grand Slam? Follow it was like two weeks after uh, yeah. the pay per view. 
Yeah. And there was a lot of hype on how are you going to do this card for Grand Slam? Because it obviously you, big stadium show, the biggest attendance. And they did deliver with that for sure. You had Danielson and Omega, though. That's why. Yeah, Danielson and Omega. I mean, you could do that. I mean, you could build a card that that is intriguing the following week for sure. Uh, I'm not I'm not as concerned with the card working out. I think, you know, if, if you're going to have uh Omega and Osprey three, for example, right? And maybe you have Bill Goldberg on this card, right? Maybe you have other things. <laughs> I think you could do a lot with that with the all in show. And then we are the Bill Goldberg the following week. We are the Bill Goldberg podcast, by the way. We are the Bill you Goldberg. Had, Nobody talks about you, Bill Goldberg as much as we do. You had the first Goldberg yeah. Austin match that people isn't that unbelievable took your word for as booked for WrestleMania. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm going to tell you, some of these websites, they've gotten so good. I don't even have to say it. If I just envision it in my head for even a split <laughs> second, they, they'll report it. You know, it's unbelievable. But, uh, you it's know, th power. there's a lot of options here. And, and I, I think now that we're going to get somewhat of a split, it's going to be. Um, I, I think developing characters and pushing people, it's going to be a little bit more organized. You know, the Wardlow situation that happened last year, I can't see that happening. Or, I mean, listen, of course it can, right? Bad booking, bad booking, bad writing, bad writing. But I, I, I Wardlow was a major drop for sure. They, they, they screwed that up. They, 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 he got the title and that was it. He got did the win see, and that was it. That, nothing else. 